A Portsmouth police officer caught in a controversy over a woman's inheritance was fired today. Sergeant Aaron Goodwin has been terminated by the Portsmouth police chief. Police say the decision comes after an extensive review into the matter, and it's one of many changes the department will be making. WMUR's Kristen Carosa has the story. Shelley, the police chief says the department is seeking to close what has been an unfortunate chapter in the otherwise proud history of the Portsmouth Police Department. Meantime, Sergeant Goodwin tells News 9 he's working on getting his career back. Residents in this Portsmouth neighborhood say it's a relief knowing that Sergeant Aaron Goodwin is off the force. I'm relieved and I think it's a just an important decision by the department. Jane Zill lived across the street from then 93-year-old Geraldine Weber who died in 2012. According to testimony given in probate court, Weber changed her will to give the bulk of her $2.7 million estate to Goodwin, something that department managers knew something about. This happened after the two developed a friendship in 2010. Some of her friends and family members have been very hurt by this actually devastated. I don't necessarily think it's a pattern or anything that's generalized about the Portsmouth police, uh, but this guy was clearly abusing his position. And that should be reason for termination. A judge is now deciding if Weber was influenced or lacked the legal capacity to change her will. Meantime, the police commission named a task force to look into the matter. The report concluded that Goodwin broke some department rules and that his managers failed to act. Um, the fact that the leadership of the department went this, let this go on so long, I think, led many citizens, myself included, to wonder about the quality of the leadership. Sergeant Goodwin released a statement to News 9. He says in part, I was given the option to resign and I chose not to. I've already started the process of getting my career back. I have every confidence that I will be reinstated. Neighbors say Goodwin doesn't deserve to be on the force and some say more changes need to be made. I don't think it's enough. I think some other key leaders maybe need to have their positions reevaluated. The police chief declined an on camera interview today, but he does say that Goodwin's termination is one of many changes that the department will be making. Reporting in the studio, Kristen Carosa, WMUR News 9.